The caruncolated caracara is one of the most representative bird species of the Antisana Para. Colorful, with its contrasting black and white plumage, an intense orange face, throat and legs, it can be seen at a distance, contrasting with the yellow moorland glasses. While black and white predominate in adult caracaras, juveniles are brown and blend in with the background. This species can be found from 2,700 meters altitude right up to the edge of the glacier. It is common to see pairs and groups of up to five individuals, but sometimes up to 50 or more have been observed. They usually build their nests in rocky areas, such as ravines with high walls. Despite being a bird of prey, the caruncolated caracara eats many things. It hunts mice, small rabbits, frogs, but is also partial to large numbers of earthworms, beetles and moths, and when the opportunity arises, carrion. The Andean Condor Never have I seen such a large and majestic bird. The flight of a condor reminds me of a glider. Effortless and silent. Condor is one of the largest birds in the world, with a wingspan of three and a half meters from tip to tip when fully open. Males are endowed with a characteristic crest on their heads and have brown eyes, while females do not have a crest and their eyes are red. Condors play a fundamental role in Andean ecosystems, since as vultures, they are responsible for cleaning them. Soaring over great distances, condors feed on the carrion of animals that die efficiently eliminating possible sources of disease in mountain habitats. Andean condors can live up to 80 years of age. They incubate only one egg at a time, and the chicks need to be cared for by their parents for at least two years. The condor is distributed throughout the Ecuadorian Andes, mainly at altitudes of between 1.5 and 4,000 meters, Paramo being its preferred habitat. Steep cliffs surrounded by vast Paramo moorlands offer quiet and safe places for the condors to roost, raise their young, as well as search for food. These remote places are key for the survival of this endangered species threatened by extinction. The population size of the Andean condor is low. According to current estimates, less than 200 individuals in all of Ecuador. Let us not forget that Andean Cosmovision reveres the condor as a messenger of the gods. The Antisana Park Rangers had told us that our visit would not be complete without first observing a singular type of bird. Apparently very abundant 10 or 15 years ago, it is nowadays rare and very elusive. After six hours on horseback, at an elevation of 3,700 meters, we came across the black-faced ibis. Still very little is known about this rare species, other than its population size is extremely low. The last census carried out in 2018 revealed an estimate of just 134 birds in the entire country, the vast majority of which are protected in this national park. In Antisana, the black-faced ibis spends several hours a day foraging in open and quiet spaces such as grassy plains, marshes, and along the banks of streams and lagoons. Mated pairs build nests and raise their chicks on high, rocky cliffs, 